too long to do these things to show. You got to show people some tools. So let's roll this week. Okay, we're, we'll do it fast. Okay. Hey, I'm Crazy Jack. We got nozzles on sale. We got gorge set. We got little hose. We got head clippers. We got everything on sale. You're gonna need these sprinklers. We got them on sale. Faster, Jack. We got wrench sets on sale. We got ropes. You want a rope of dope? Rope them with that. We got gas matches. How much are they, Jack? One dollar. They're a buck. It's if you want to squirt oil cans, we got oil cans. We got these big screw drivers. We got electrical tape. We got T-handled Allen wrenches. We got wood planers. We got 40 sheets of sandpaper, two dollars. We got sockets down here for a dollar. We got wrenches, dollar a piece. We got impact drivers, six dollars. We got these little brushes for 75 cents. We got duct tape. Three dollars a roll. We got everything down in here. We got crow's feet. I didn't know crows had feet. I don't think he do. Okay, so we got everything. We got safety glasses. We got drill beds. Hi, hon. We got Hi. wrenches down here. We got rollers, paint rollers down here. When your car gets dirty and greasy, we got the rags down here. Look at these, down here. Look at these screwdriver sets. $14.95. We got everything down here. Excuse me, sir. I didn't mean to drop that on your head. <laughs> we got everything down here. Look up here. We got drills. $38 skills. We got plastic flashlights. $1.75. Get tired. You know what is Jack's trying to tell you? The bottom line of it is Jack has everything down here, JD tools in the farmer's market, and it's cheaper than everybody else. Right. We also got these carts. $39.95. They'll hold 350 pounds. Your turn. JD tools in the farmer's market open Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays. Let's take a look at this. I'm done with women. Jimmy, there's plenty of women out there. 17 years ago, look, I found the right one. Were you happy? I'm very happy, and there's plenty of women out there for you, too. Where? Look, there's a couple over there. Oh, wow. Jimmy, you want me to help you out with those two girls over there? Oh, I don't know, Jack. You'd do that for me? Certainly I would. Jimmy, old buddy, let me go handle this for you. me a drink and take me outside and show me why they call you Jimmy Biggs. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. Oh. That's what we're going to be doing all night long because we have the snow and everything. It's Monday night. We've uh, kind of lost all of our guests for tonight, have we not, Danny? Anybody show that was up one yet? good looking chick, man. Oh, yeah. Jimmy, did you get her phone number? <laughs> I'm telling you, unbelievable. That, the, the fun we have, though. But we got a lot of those from different shows that we've done throughout the, I guess this is our, what, 15th show now? You, you know, I was down yeah. there counting the tapes. I think it's more than that. I yeah. think it might be around 17, Well, there's a couple 18. of tapes we got rid of, too, yeah. so <laughs> we ain't going to show no clips from. But we got a lot more clips and everything we're going to be going through from uh, prior shows that we've done in the past and uh, yeah, I things think like that. Yeah, sometime in May, I think we're going to schedule a, like a, uh, the best of. Well, this is going to be the best of tonight <laughs> because that's all we got, buddy. I mean, to tell no, you, other than the great salami! Yeah, 
Ça cesse. Yeah, we're going to be doing a commercial break, and when we come back, you're going to have an opportunity to call in. Now, remember, you got to have your uh, your birthday. Your, what else? What else do you need? Your visa card. <laughs> your visa card. We're going to take a commercial break, and when we come back, you're going to call in, and talk to the great Salami. Plus, we're going to talk to some of the other cast of characters around on the show, and find out what they do when they're not here doing the Monday night around town. We'll be right back uh, right after this. It's an exciting show for you, anyways. And next week, our guest is going to be here, and that's going to be the Emeralds Doo Wop group. Uh, remember the song Doo Wop? Well, they're going to be here, and they're going to perform that. For us, we're going to take your phone calls. I hear the phone already starting to ring and everything, but don't call right now. We're going to wait just a couple minutes because I want to introduce my first guest, I guess I should say, of the night because we're going to bring a lot of guests on before the night's over with. But my first guest as of tonight, the great Salami. Put your hands together and welcome. How, how are you? Good, good. How are you? Good. Now, you had these uh, feelings all your life that you can... Uh, figure things out and everything uh, probably started maybe seven or eight years ago really strong oh yeah yeah, yeah. any any major predictions you've predicted so far or? i predicted it was going to snow today oh yeah well that's pretty good yeah, yeah my wife well, she it wanted came to... true it, it's, yeah. it's happening so that that's that's a little legit in itself right there the fact that it snowed and jack predict anything else you predict jack uh, we uh, it was like i had to cut the grass i hoped it would snow my wife's laughing Oh, so you got that, that kind of power where you can bring that on and everything. Uh, but, we, you know, we, we want to talk a little bit about that. But I, I know that we got to show, because we're going to take phone calls. You're going to mm -hmm. answer some people's personal questions and things like that. And before we do that, i I got to show you your powers and everything. So, uh, Jimmy, we, we before the show and everything, Jimmy Biggs, of course. Everybody, this is Jimmy Biggs. This is the guy that directs the show every now and then and tries to help us out. Uh, we're all correcting them. Okay, okay, okay. So, so, oh yeah, you're out of here now. Jimmy got on the show tonight because it's snowing outside. If you're watching this any other night, it's not snowing outside. It's supposed to be like 60, what is it, what's it, temperature? 50 degrees tomorrow. I know yeah, yeah, tomorrow. yeah, 70 like uh, Friday coming up too. So if you're watching this any other time other than Monday, this is the reason that we brought the great salami instead of mm -hmm. Ann Kubal. Ann Kubal will be back sometime here uh, in May, I guess. Is that right? Yeah. yeah, okay, in May she's coming back. Danny McEwen is with me, Eddie Agria, and that's pretty much it. Mooney came, Mooney is out there. If he, if people can keep him awake he's out there with us and uh but jack i, I shouldn't so you don't like me to call you that when you're wearing the turban it's not, the not great tonight. salami yeah. so yes uh, okay i apologize for that but what we did jimmy and i got together and we decided to put some uh questions inside some envelopes and everything and what you know you said your powers were so strong you could read through walls yeah. and you know things like that i'll give and you what an I, answer yeah that's what i'm hoping that you'll do is give me the answer to these questions and all mm -hmm. so uh if you could we start off with this one here Gate. Heaven's Gate. Okay. Heaven's Gate. Heaven's <laughs> Gate. Heaven's <laughs> is that what it is? Gate. Heaven's Gate. Heaven's Gate. The, the place 39 people from L.A. won't see. Okay. Oh, I don't know about that. Oh, no, no. I ain't going that way. I ain't going that way. No, no, no. Okay, okay. Question number two, Jack, if you would. Oh, this is an easy one. Twenty nine ninety five. Twenty nine ninety five. You got that, Danny? Twenty nine. 29 Rob K. Twenty nine ninety five. Okay. And uh, the question being, what can you buy J and D collectible limited edition collector truck for twenty nine ninety five? And as a great salami, I'm telling you, he's got him. He's got him right here. Okay, the great salami, unbelievable. We got some more questions. Everything I want to remind everybody the reason we're doing this with the great salami is Ann Kubal couldn't be here. But we're gonna tell. We got a telephone number, Jimmy. We got a telephone. Oh, we're not ready for the telephone. Okay, okay. We got more questions. Okay. He's, he's legit. Okay, he is. He is legit. Okay, and, and this one here, if you would. Oscar. Oscar. You got that? Oscar. <laughs> Oscar. 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 Audience, you got that? What is it? Oscar. Oscar. Okay. What? Okay. I remember back when there, there was a, a movie that debuted here not too long ago. We we had put, showed a movie that local guys did. They uh, yeah. This is dressed to dap. What? What he won't get for his first TV movie. Okay, Dap. What you won't get. All right. <laughs> I can't, I can't believe, I can't believe that uh, you came up with this. I mean, oh, I'm, yeah, yeah. I'm, we haven't this, even this got is unreal. Started. This is unreal. I can't believe some of the things that you've come up with. I mean, this is just getting underway here. Ooh, 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 ooh. Sixty-nine. 
Oh, 69! <laughs> 69, okay. What was the temperature yesterday? 69! All right. Yeah, you filthy-minded people out there. I know where you were going. I know I know where Danny was going. Danny's always filthy-minded. So, all right, here we go. This is, uh, we're, we're, we're up to question number five here. So, this is proven the great salami. We're going to take your phone calls here in a minute. What we need you to have ready for us is your uh, birth date and, and what sign you are and all that kind of stuff, right? <laughs> yeah, credit card number. That's yes, right. I take Visa and MasterCard <laughs> to discover. Poison gas. Poison gas. Here we oh. go. Oh, man, I'm telling you. What does Jimmy Biggs give off after he eats baked beans? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Rob Kay's joining in the show here. I'm glad to have you with me tonight, Rob. Where's the rest of the band at? Let me ask you, did you talk to the band at all? Well, they are here. They are here. You just don't see them at the present moment. But they are here playing they with are you. Here. And in heart anyways, well, right? Well, Dave has a hangnail. Uh, he's nursing that at home. Um, I think I Anthony's thought maybe his hair wouldn't comb right or something. Well, something like that. Yeah. And Anthony's somewhere out in the Jersey Turnpike. And uh, Jimmy, well, you know, drugs. Yeah. He's still trying to that's, find that's a place. That's it. I'm telling you, unbelievable night out there tonight. I, I, did, did you have any problems getting in? No, you know, once I got the reindeer to like, you know, keep that's, us that's what I was course, going for. Was I'm good. telling you, it's a bunch of nuts on here tonight, but we're having fun. We're going to question number six with the great salami. This is unbelievable, people. He's predicting the answer before he sees the question right here. One hundred. One hundred. So, ready for this, Danny? What, what do we got here? Jimmy Biggs and Crazy Jack's combined waist size. Oh. <laughs> Are we having fun? Are, are, are we having fun yet? Okay. We're, hey, don't go anywhere because we got another 40 minutes of this. I'm telling you. <laughs> you want to stay right there. I know I would if I was at home right now. Okay. Well, I got to say hi to somebody before we go any further because she's 20 minutes past her bedtime right now. Alex, if you're watching, that's my sweetheart, little angel, my niece. Go to bed. Okay. <laughs> hi, by the way. And we'll see you here in a couple of days. All right. You ready? Question number seven. <laughs> here we go, here we go. Who in Delaware has no talent and shouldn't be on TV? Okay. <laughs> oh, low, low blows, too, on top of that. Oh, okay, okay, all right. The great salami, by the way, great salami. A fantastic job. How many questions are we doing here? Okay, this is question number eight. Number eight. Oh, he's in a heavy concentration here. Ooh. <laughs> he can't do it when I'm talking. Is that what you're trying to tell me? Mother-in-law's basement. Mother-in-law's basement. Mother-in-law's basement. Where does Tim do his clothes shopping? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. What's this all of a sudden pick on Tim? Is this, is, you know? That's what I see. Uh, is that what you see? And the final, the last question of the night. Am I correct? Final question. Number nine, yeah, it's number nine, but I don't see a number ten, so it's the last question of the night. All right. Ten top reasons why Jack's sitting there. <laughs> Can't feel it? Call NASA. Call NASA. <laughs> What's the fastest way to follow a UFO and a comet? <laughs> Oh, not no word. All right, that's a great. I told you the great salami right here tonight. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you're out there watching, we're going to get ready. We're going to be taking some phone calls here shortly. Uh, what we got to do first is everything. It's back. Love Can't Make Me Wait. Who sang that song, Danny? Oh, that was uh, Major Harris. Major Harris. And, and we had Major Harris on the show and everything, right? No, we had, uh, that was. Uh, oh, no. Bill, uh, Who do we have on the show? Uh, Poochie. That was uh, William Poochie. Hart. William Hart. Okay, so Major Harris and Bill Bill Hart did that then. Because we can't hear you at all, so. And that you're talking away over there. If you step over that microphone with Rob, you afraid to get near Rob? Is that what it is? No, no, I trust them. I slept <laughs> with him before. He's harmless. Okay, okay. Well, let's, let, let's, uh, uh, now Major Harris and... No, and but Major Harris was one of the original Delphonics. Okay. Major Harris sang Love Won't Let Me Wait. 
that it was uh, Bobby Eli. As a matter of fact, one of our regulars. Bobby had wrote and produced that tune. Oh, did he write it? Yes, he did. Oh, wow, powerful. Yes, he did. Powerful. You wouldn't pick, pick Bobby Eli doing that, would you? No, well, Bobby's got a lot of talents. Oh, I imagine he does. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to know what the rest of them are. Acting's not one of them. No, no, no I'm no. only kidding, Bobby. He's a good boy. <laughs> but we, 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 wanted, uh, uh, we, we have a clip, do we not, from that original show and everything? Is it all ready and set to go? Am, or am I throwing something? Are, uh, am I throwing you under the bus? Uh, yeah. Ryan? Ryan's doing a fantastic. Give Ryan, nobody ever talks about Ryan. Does a fantastic job in the booth each and every week. I mean, if it wasn't for Ryan, if it wasn't for Ryan, none of this would happen. Brown Town Live, sponsored by Frank Orsini's Topsoil out here in Hocassin. Don't get us mixed up with anybody else. We got everything you need. We got Topsoil. We got fill dirt. We, we, we got sod. We got anything you want out here. It doesn't matter. A bucket full, a truckload, we'll deliver it anywhere. As long as you're not in North Canada. He's got everything out here you need. All you landscapers out there that are in business. And one thing about Frank Orsini, he's not going to raise the prices or jack them up. Ah! Yeah. Can we talk Come to here. you about Eddie? Uh, oh, man, great guy, man. Isn't he the funniest funny guy we've had on the show and everything? I love him. Hey, guys, I've really got to get ready. i got to get, uh, get on air. See, here. You're no help. Yeah, how come he gets help, paid every man. week and we get a check once a month? Yeah, told me to get coffee for him come, yesterday. Come here, man. Hey, hey, what's up, man? He gets paid every week. We get paid once a month. Who, who are you talking about? Eddie, there's no Eddie. living water, oh, man. Eddie. He's got to head this big. Who, Eddie Aguirre? Yeah. Hey, Eddie's the big draw on the Eddie, show. You know Eddie gets more mail than you clowns, okay? Eddie, Eddie stays. The boss likes him. Eddie stays. I don't want to hear it. Eddie stays. Yeah, Eddie ain't no good. Yeah. All right, come on, guys, move out of the way. Eddie, get set up with your lines. Practice your lines so you don't screw them up this week. Come on, guys, hey, move out of the way. Would you? Thank you very much. Come on, okay, yeah, go ahead. ahead. Thank you, Dan. Hey. Hi, uh, this is Eddie Aguirre, and uh, what you guys going to do, huh? <laughs> Looking good, Ed. Looking yeah. good. Yeah, thanks. Thank you very much. Thank <laughs> 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 Go, fellas. Line, line. Woman, you did. It's the round town. You know, Eddie, it's been a couple of weeks you've been working with us here at Around Town, and I, I really don't know too much about you. Uh, what country are you from? Yes. Yes. Are you married? Yes. Do you have any children? How many do you have? Yes. <laughs> Eddie, during the Christmas holiday season, have you ever got down on your knees and lick the balls on the Christmas tree? <laughs> yes. Hey, Eddie, have you ever ate a loaf pinched by a German shepherd on a hot summer day? Yes. <laughs> Wait a second. A couple weeks ago, you were singing happy birthday on the show. You mean to tell me... Oh, happy birthday. Happy birthday. No, 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 no. Don't, please, don't sing happy birthday. You mean happy birthday and yes is the only English you know? No. It's a round time live from Wilmington. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's what I can see him doing next, coming through. Woo! Woo! Excuse me, sir, did you see what happened? Yeah, yeah, I did. <laughs> You remember that, Jack? You don't remember that at all, do you? I don't know. But this is Around Town Live, and it's live, and we guaranteed that we was going to go live. Everybody was calling, saying we're going to do the show. And Rob K said, I'm going to be there. I don't care about the rest of you. So this is how many of us got down here. And one of the people that got down here, because Ann Kubal was supposed to be with us, the psychic, as you know, and she does a fantastic job. Well, she couldn't get out of Philadelphia to get over here to do the show tonight. So we had the great Salami show up, and... Uh, sitting in for Ann Kubal and everything. Of course, we try to prove it to you to begin with, uh, you know, at the beginning of the show here so we can take phone calls and try to help some people mm -hmm. out and guide them in the right direction in the future and that type of deal. Am I correct there? Yes. 
Okay, this is going to be exciting, isn't it? Uh, I'm ready. Wait, wait, I think we should prove it with just one more. We got, we, we did find the final, final one, and if you uh, could, uh, just uh, do that for me. Mm, this is a tough one. What? Oh, high heels and lipstick. High heels and lipstick. No, I mean, what, what? This is the last thing that I when I seen your wife that she was wearing. <laughs> Come on, Jack. <laughs> oh, oh, I don't think so. I, I, I just went to doghouse. I thought, what the heck? Here, here we are. We're doing live. We don't have anything else to do. Telephone number up here is anybody know? Ryan does. I bet you Ryan can put it on the screen and everything. Because we're going to take some calls. There it is. 658-8255 is the telephone number. That's 658-8255. I knew it wasn't going to be long before this phone started ringing. I'm going to take a chance. Now, remember, this is live television. So if you would, please be careful. Hi, how you doing? Oh, I guess you ain't doing too good. <laughs> Why didn't you predict they was going to hang up on us? Here we go. Here we go. Hello there. How are you? Oh, I'm fine. How are you? Good. Uh, and everything going all right with you? Oh, uh, well, it's okay. Has anybody told you how wonderful you sound tonight? <laughs> oh, okay. What, what, when's your birthday? 8 66. 66? And I'm a Leo. And you're a Leo? Great salami. What do you see? Actually, don't I get to ask him a question? Oh, you, you can do so. Yeah. Go right ahead. Will I ever appear on TV? Oh, would, you, would she ever appear on TV? Does she have the post office box number? Well, I got a good idea. Just jump up on top of it and you'll be on top of your TV. You're on TV, right? I, <laughs> would that work? Yeah. Uh, what, post office box? That's right. And if we could do that real quick. If you want to be on this program or any of the programs we have, send your letters and stuff to Positive Promotion, 26 Fox Hunt Drive, Suite 188, Bear, Delaware, 19701. Send photographs, whatever you want to send, and uh, Danny will take care of you. Yeah, and uh, we're going to go through the phone again. I, I don't know how many times I want to go through this. Hi, how you doing? Hi, is this Tim? This is, I, it depends on who's calling. Well, I just wanted to uh, call and just ask you, uh, just tell you a couple of things. Uh, I have to give you a lot of credit for putting on, you know, as many shows as you do on Channel 28. Well, I appreciate that. And have you seen uh, Joker's World on Channel 28 at 7 o'clock on Friday night? No, I haven't. Oh, it's a great show. And that's what, what's it called? It's called Joker's World. It's on Channel 28 at, at 7 o'clock on Friday night. J Joker's World. What's it about? Uh, it's sort of like a cross between, like, uh, Saturday Night Live, Saturday Night Live, Howard Stern, uh, David Letterman, the whole thing. Oh, yeah? And who's the host of it? Uh, his name is Joker, I think. Oh, yeah? Yeah, that's why it's probably called Joker's World. Oh, is, is that why you call it Joker's World? Yeah, that's what I think he calls it. Oh, yeah? He's, he's the guy who called Joker, I guess. Yeah, and are, are you the Joker by chance? No. What, uh, maybe the Riddler. I don't know about all that. No, I, 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 hey, we got to do something. We got to fill some time. You have something for the great salami here? Well, the thing I like to know is, um, where do you learn to sell as well as you do, and to talk people in advertising on Channel 28 on their worst quality show and pay the highest price? Uh, because they want to get results. All right, hey, all right. Yeah. 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 Hi, Joker. <laughs> take them. I don't care. Hey, it's all in fun. It, 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 as I always said, Jimmy, there's always them ones out there. Hi, how you doing? Hey, do you get laid because you have a show like this? Yes, I do. Oh, you're the man. Yeah, 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 yeah. What, what the heck? <laughs> They're coming tonight, I'm telling you. Hi, how you doing? Yeah, uh, Slimy, can you give me a uh, production here? Yes. How long is this horrible show going to last? About, about, another, about another 25 minutes. What I love about it is all these people that's watching. Now, I gotta tell you, stay right with us. We're having fun. How you doing? Okay, that's what that's the way I felt about it too. The great salami's here with us. The phone lines are open. We're gonna keep on taking them. How you doing? How are you? Good. And yourself? Good. Who am I, who am I talking with? This is Madeline. Madeline. Yes. Okay, Madeline, you have a, a question for the great salami or a comment you want to make? Let me ask um, the great salami. Who's the best limousine company? Who's the best looking what? The best limousine company. Who's the best limousine company? That's DNT. Oh, he's going to get them all in there. He don't know. <laughs> Man, who knows? Who's the best limousine company? I, 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 TNT? TNT. TNT. Who's the best limousine company? Best limousine company. TNT? TNT. TNT? It was coming around. I come in with the <laughs> TNT. has got to be that, the that best. That works. That's the TNT limo, 995-8960. If you've got an ad you want to put on the air right now, you can do so. Uh, we're having fun, Rob. <laughs> and, and drop your check down at the farmer's market for that one. <laughs>
All right, the great salami. Telephone number once again, 658, what's the number here? 6588 talk. Talk. 658 talk. That's it. Yeah. Or you can call positive promotion to 425551. <laughs> but you can call this number all throughout the night here. It's uh, <laughs> if I'm not here, Ryan will take it. I'm afraid to take any more phone calls. This is fun now. Are you ready, ready, Jack? How you doing? Hello? Hello? How are you? Bubba Bowie. Bubba Bowie? This, I, I don't care what they... I have no idea. Bubba Louie and all this. Bubba <laughs> whatever, whatever. It's fun. Hey, Rob, should we take some more phone calls? Let's try one more. Let's try one more. Are you sure? And this is the one. If whatever it is, we're going to take it, right? I'm feeling some psychic ability running over here. And this, uh -huh. is, this is the one. Hi, how you doing? This is a great show. I don't care what anybody says. I'm really enjoying it. Well, I thank you so much because we didn't have a whole lot of planning to do with it. So uh, it's people like you to make it happen. I really appreciate you watching. Well, keep up the good job because we're really enjoying My wife and I really like you. Okay, well, I thank you so much. Thank you. All right. That's, that's, hey, they're out there. <laughs> There's a few. But look how many people are watching. They're always watching. I don't care. It's, it's fun. We enjoy it. And if you want to call in, you can pick up the phone call 658-8255 and speak with the great Salami. Nobody's asking you a whole lot of questions here. Any other predictions that you made that might might help them? The snow's going to stop in 15 minutes. The snow's going to stop in 15 minutes. That sounds like a winner. That sounds like a winner. Hey, hi, how you doing? I'm well, thank you. I called earlier and you disconnected me. I was the first caller. Okay, the well, video, the, yeah, the, uh, and the great salami. The great salami. The one that I wouldn't exactly call. <laughs> I, 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 sick. Um, actually, what, what do you... He was supposed to make a prediction for me. Is she going to be making on TV? Well, actually... Say yes, you are. Tim... Sure she will. Tim. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> All right. She's still on? Yeah. Oh, no, Wait. she's gone. <laughs> Tell her to come on in. <laughs>